Hi, this is Dahlia. I'm part of the horticulture team here at Rogers Gardens. And today I'm gonna to be talking to you about what is an organic garden? Which leads me to the next question. What is the most important thing in the soil besides the soil itself? And that is soil biology. Soil biology is a living organism. And like any living organism, the better the food that it consumes, the stronger that it will be. Like we are a living organism, one big living organism. So the stronger and the better that the food that I consume, the stronger that I'm going to be, the healthier I'm going to be, the better I'm going to look. Well, if you looked under a microscope at some really healthy soil, uh, something that's got some cow manure, bat guano, worm castings, forest humus, all of that good organic stuff, what you're going to see is a whole bunch of microorganisms and bacteria. And microorganisms and bacteria are just a lot of little critters that are in here. I mean, you can't see millions and millions of little critters in here. They're all just munching away and they're doing their job. And what they're doing is they're breaking down this organic matter into a form which is very easy for the plant to take up and consume. So remember, you are what you eat. So whatever this plant eats, that's what you're gonna be eating. That's why it's really important to add a lot of organic material into the soil so that you are feeding these microorganisms what they need so that they can turn around and feed your plants. Also, another thing that I think is really important is when you fertilize. Anytime you pick up a fertilizer at the nursery, it should say certified organic. Make sure that you're buying only certified organic because every time that you're buying a synthetic fertilizer, what you're doing is you're killing all of the natural organisms that are in that soil to make this plant strong. Okay, now if you go out there into your garden and you see a worm or some kind of a bug eating at your vegetables or your fruit, don't panic. Don't run out and get some heavy duty pesticide. You don't need that. There's a lot of wonderful organic uh, sprays and uh, things that you can use that will organically get rid of the worm because you do not want to be killing the worms plus the bees plus the butterflies plus everything else that this earth needs in order to be uh, organic and also not only are you killing a bunch of stuff with all these pesticides but you're also killing yourself remember you are what you eat and uh, when you're spraying a bunch of stuff on your plants, that's what you're eating too. So it's important to go ahead and, and get a, uh, one of the organic uh, type of sprays. And there's a lot of great ones out there. Once again, this is Dahlia. And thank you so much for joining me today. I really want to encourage you to uh, use your organic soils, your organic matters, your, your adding the microorganisms to the soil, which turns around and feeds the plants to make them strong, so that what you're eating makes you strong. Remember, don't use any pesticides in the garden because you want to not eat the pesticides either. I want you to be happy, and in order for you to be happy, you need to be healthy.